and also the notification bell so you don't miss any of our future videos. But let's get right into our review today. They claim that they can take look at your genetics and they tell you what kind of exercise works best for you. And it also tells you how many carbs, protein, and fat you should be consuming. Basically your macros that's best for your body type. That was super intriguing to me. I just had a baby about a year ago and I had him when I was 40. And as opposed to my other two babies where I was able to lose the baby weight really quickly, I am 40, I'm 41 now. And it's a little harder. A year later and I still haven't lost the baby weight. I'm still 20 pounds more than I was before I got pregnant. In fact, when I got Got pregnant I um, told my husband I said take one look at this body honey because you were never gonna see it again because <laughs> I knew it was gonna be harder to lose weight uh. this time than it was for my previous pregnancies and that's totally fine I'm cool with that my last my baby is worth it and I'm fine to carry 20 extra pounds to have them but now that a year's gone by I'm starting to question maybe I can lose this weight that's what intrigued me about this test I'm really excited to try it so we're gonna open this up I haven't done this test yet Janet has it's a saliva mm -hmm. test so we're gonna just do the test right now okay all right I am so excited I'm gonna go through the process step by step so that you know what to expect when you order this test so step one it says activate you start out online and that is they give you a, a unique code so get out your materials which is the cap from the silver packet that's on the end of that swab you don't want to touch it to anything else but you're going to rub the swab firmly inside both cheeks in a circular motion for 30 seconds on each side use both sides of the swab okay google set a timer for 30 seconds we want to point out is that when I saw this I went straight to step one so I didn't notice these two big red exclamation marks right here and right here that gives some extra instructions it says do not skip the step you can't obtain your results without activating your test so we know that but right here it says do not brush eat drink or smoke within 60 minutes of the collection and don't do not touch the swab tip with anything but your cheek to avoid contamination now we have our test it's complete and I just need to drop it in the mail and then wait, wait for a month so in the meantime I've been exercising I went for a run yesterday first time in a long time it killed me <laughs> and um, I'm gonna lay off the carbs a little bit and maybe the Captain Crunch when I get these results, it'll come by email, but then I get to have a consultation with their geneticist. I'm really excited about that because I'm, I'm actually kind of a science geek. Now, let's talk a little bit about the cost of the kit. It is about $300, and that's kind of a, a high price to pay, but... Oh, and thank you to Live Genetics for sending me this test. Yeah, I, really I paid for mine. She wanted it so bad, and the company agreed to send her one. So we're going to compare our results and see how they're different. You know what? I paid more than that over time for gyms, memberships. I only fit into one pair of shorts and one <laughs> pair of jeans right now. So buying new wardrobe will cost more than $300 yeah. right there. And I don't want to. I'm just going to... The guy that that introduced me to all this, John. He's a slim guy and he always has been, but he always had a belly. No matter what he did, he would exercise more, lift higher, harder. But when he got his genetics test, which he has had for over five years, that now he does, he lost his belly and he knows what to do and it's just his roadmap for his life. For number three, my motivation, I felt motivated the minute I got this test. It already made me start wanting to exercise more, mostly because um, I feel like, hey, with a little bit of help from my genes, I actually maybe really can get rid of this baby weight. We'll come back to you after a month when I get the results. We're back and we have our genetics test results. So Hi. excited. This was so interesting to go over. So what we wanna do is just kinda generally tell you what is included in the test so you know what to expect when you get yours. The three things that this test is gonna tell you is what you need to do as far as exercise. How much, how intense, to get the best health, your optimal health. Two, it's gonna tell you what to eat, so your macros. And number three, it tells you what supplements you can take. So let's dive in. This is how many pages? 12 pages of information. So first, our do. This is what ours looks like. And Diana and I are similar. And it just tells us how intense we need to work out and how often. It recommends 20% low intensity and 80% high intensity. And then it goes and breaks that down a little bit more to specify 
I need to do eight to 12 high intensity exercises per month. And high intensity, it specifies that I need to get my heart rate in between 124 to 150 beats per minute for 30 to 45 minutes. And then I have to do low intensity two to three times a month. And it specifies that heart rate too, which is 88 to 115, so a little bit lower. So it kind of takes the guesswork out of it. So mine says I need to do 10%, 90% high, but my high is lower than yours. But I think the next most valuable part is our macros. We now know how much fat, protein, and carbs intake we need to have and our sensitivity to carbs and fat. For me, it turns out I am highly carb sensitive and I am highly fat sensitive. And then last, it talks about what supplements you're gonna take. And this is where it kind of gets into the DNA, your, D, your specific genes and what they looked at for this test. This individualizes your workout plan, your diet, and your supplements based upon your genetics. I think that's so cool. One interesting thing about the vitamins and what's gonna work for you is that if you've heard of the weight loss supplement CLA, sometimes people take that and it works great and then other people take it and it doesn't work great. And you just think, why isn't it working for me? And the reason is, is because, and we've learned this through this test, some people, about what, 20, 30%, right around there, of the population, they have the gene that processes that CLA supplement to help you lose weight. She has that gene. Yes. But the, other, the rest of the population don't. So for me, if I were to take the CLA supplement, it's not gonna do anything for me. So for me, it didn't recommend that I take it because it's not gonna do me any good. I appreciate knowing that so that I don't ever have to waste my money trying a supplement that just isn't gonna work for me. So this just talks about you know what you can take and like we talked about, um, it talks about what supplements work for you. If you want to take your own genetics test for health and fitness and weight loss or whatever your health goals are, we're gonna put a link in our video description to ours and we're also gonna show you where to go on their website to order one. Now that I have this roadmap, my personal recipe, and I don't feel like it's a secret recipe, I just feel like it's, it's a specific recipe just for me, so I'm gonna do it. And I'm gonna follow this plan exactly. Since I got these results back, I've already started, just barely started to integrate this. I have some weight loss goals. I talked about it at the beginning of this video. So stay tuned because our next video is going to be about how this worked for me. Did, was I able to reach my goals? Was I able to take the supplements? Did they make me feel good? So watch for that next video coming up.